الحمد لله الحمد لله نحمده ونستعينه ونستغفره ونؤمن به ونتوكل عليه ونعوذ بالله من شرور انفسنا ومن سيئات اعمالنا من يهد الله فلا مضل له ومن يضلل فلا هادي له ونشهد ان لا اله الا الله ونشهد ان محمدا عبده ورسوله وقال الله تعالى في القران المجيد والفرقان الحميد ومن يشاقق الرسول من بعد ما تبين له الهدى ويتبع غير سبيل المؤمنين نوليه نوليه ما تولى ونصليه جهنم وساءت مصيرا آمنت بالله صدق الله العظيم إن الله وملائكته يصلون على النبي يا ايها الذين امنوا صلوا عليه وسلموا تسليما اللهم صل على سيدنا ومولانا محمد المرتضى بالملوان وتاق الاسرار وكر الجديد واستقل البرقدان وبلغ روحه وارض اهل بيته من التهيئه والسلام وبارك وسلم عليه كثيرا 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 my dear respected elders my brothers assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh wa alaykum assalam asadak allah ta'ala fi ad-darayn khayra allah kareem allah the almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala gives you blessing in this life and hereafter give you successful life in this world and hereafter my dear brother today our topic is about protection from devils all the time we need protection from devils because if we have not protections if we will not care the devil can waste dissolve delete demolish to all our good deeds to all our good activities because allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not like to bad activities and minor and major sins because devil is a enemy of allah the almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala an enemy of the beloved prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and devil is enemy of great saint of allah the almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala meaning companions of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and awliya kiram and mu'minin kamilin those believers they have proper belief upon allah subhanahu wa taala upon holy quran on messengers on day of judgment and all adjustment which one allah subhanahu wa taala had declared had arranged had fixed had complete my dear brothers this is the love of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala with creation the before any laws allah the almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala had explained in form to people this way is bad for you this act is bad for you and this act is good for you you will enter in paradise by this act <coughs> my dear brother devils and partner of devils which one meaning evils and those people they are living in this world they are not caring 
about statements of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, about verses of the Holy Quran, about the Sunnah of beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, about this declaration of beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. These are all partner of devil. Today, in our culture, or different peoples, for example, they are working in films and dramas, and they are arranging a stage drama, and they said, Inshallah Ta'ala, we will be successful in this city, and our drama will be success successful, or my film will be success. Inshallah Ta'ala, I hope on Allah the Almighty Subhanahu Wa Look, one side is a, is a partner of devils. They are stopping people, they are stopping to people from prayers, from Holy Quran, from Sunnah, from good activities, from good acts. They are stopping them, stopping the people. But they said, Inshallah Ta'ala, with blessing of Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala, we will be successful. This is a blame upon Allah, the Almighty. Allah Azawajal likes to good deeds, to good activities, to Sunnah of beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So then, my dear brothers, today is a very different condition in mosque. Today is Friday. You can see how many people will come for Friday prayer. And other side you see is arena, if any drama or stage drama and singing program will be there. And 50,000 people will be there and they will dance with singers. This is a big loss, my friend. <coughs> if the people will not care, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, I will leave them on this position and I will throw them in hellfire. My dear brother, a big scholar, great scholar, Hazrat Umar bin Muhammad, Shahabuddin Sorwardi Rahmatullah, he was a great scholar. He said, the devil has a 1,000, above to, above to 1,000 tricks for tracking. 1,000 tricks for tracking to people, tracking for minor and major sins. And if we have a knowledge, and if we will be expert in this matter, in this field, in this department, then we can be saved and secured from devils and partners of devils. And if we will not care, only prayer time coming, for prayer, after prayer, we are busy in other activities. Work. We are not thinking about devil tricks, devil dodge, and dodge of partners of devil. If we will not be serious, if we will not care about tricks of devil, any time devil can hold us from our neck and can involve in minor and major sins in any criminal activities, then will be a big loss. But Allah the Almighty Subhanahu wa Ta'ala says, you come at right path, you offer prostrate of front of me, you request me, I will forgive you, you promise with me, you will not do again, I will forgive you. Meaning Tawbat and Nasu. So my dear brother, this is this world is a ground of war with devil. This world, our life, in this life, we are in ground of war against the devil and partner of devils should be knowledge, should be practical life, according to Sunnah of Prophet Muhammad 
Inshallah, then we can be successful. My dear brother, indeed, this is no doubt, the all harmful or bad or criminal activities, indeed, opinions and waves will be from devils and partner of devils. All bad activities will be against the Sunnah of Beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And when we will follow the Sunnah of Beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, automatically we can get a protection from devils, protection of Allah the Almighty Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala against devils and minor and major sins. But when we will try, when we will a request to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, then inshallah we will be successful. And this is this is the result, moral decision. This is a proper decision. The devil if is enemy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and beloved prophets. The devil was enemies of all messengers. Devil is the enemy of companions and follower of pillar prophet. Devil is the enemy of great saint and believers. So that my dear brother, Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَمَنْ يُشَاكِكَ رَسُولًا مِنْ بَعْدِ مَا تَبَيَّنَ لَهُ الْهُدَى وَيَتَّبِعَ غَيْرَ سَبِيلِ الْمُؤْمِنِينَ نُوَلِّهِ مَا تَوَلَّى وَنُسْلِهِ جَهَنَّمْ وَسَاءَتْ مَصِيرًا Surah Al-Nisa, verse number 115. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, anyone, if anyone or which one will, will go against the path of beloved Prophet, he will go against the sunnah of beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. After this, he knows about all conditions, about verses, about decisions, about announcement, about declaration of beloved prophet. After this, he will go against the beloved prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa And he is a believer. And he is a walk at the other path of Muslims, meaning he is a walk at the wrong path. He will not walk at the right path. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, we will leave them on this way and we will throw them in hellfire. We will throw them in hellfire. If anyone contends with the apostle even after guidance has been plainly conveyed to him and follows a path other than that be coming to men of faith we shall leave him in the path he has chosen and land him in hell what an evil refuge wasaat masira aur kya hi buri paladne ki jagah help hai there's too much bad place. No one can get peace in hellfire. All the time we will get punishment. Allah. My dear brother, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, or Jo Rasul ki mukhalfat kare, baad iske ke haq rasta us par khul chuka, aur musulmano ki raast se juda rasta chale, hum usko uski halat par chhod denge. We will leave them on this path he has chosen aur kya hum usko uski halat par chhod denge aur usko dozakh mein daakhil karenge we will enter him in hell fire aur kya hi buri paladne ki jagah allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says hell fire is a too much bad place if anyone he will return in hell fire my dear brothers we have a time we have a fixed time. Sometime our Muslim brother said, oh, 
my heart is not accepting, my heart is not accepting. What is meaning? God is not accepting. We are not justice. We are not independent. We can't amendments and alterations in rules and regulation of Islam. We can't amendment in statements of Allah the subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala. We can't amendment in the declaration of beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. What is better for us? This is better for us when we will accept our all minor and major sins, our criminal activities, we will accept to our fault and then we will request at front of Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala, Oh my God, oh my Lord, I am a criminal, I accept I am a criminal, please forgive me by the beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa And when we will try for right path, for sunnah, for sunnah, I can't understand. Once upon a time I was uh, going for Umrah, I think last year. Taxi driver, he was Muslim, but he belonged from, I think, Syria or any other Muslim country, he was Muslim. He said, where are you going? I said, I'm going for Umrah. And then he said, what is the meaning of Umrah? You don't know about Makkah. He said, which Makkah? He said, which Makkah? Where is Makkah? I can tell people's uh, goals and people went for uh, Hajj. He said, I don't know what is the meaning of Hajj, what is the meaning of Makkah, what is the meaning of Umrah. He was a Muslim. My dear brothers, there are so many conditions in this matter. Number one, maybe he is living in area where all people was uh, the old people were living, un unbelievable or kafir people were living. He could not understand, he could not get Islamic knowledge. Or otherwise, what a second condition, he did not care about, he did not care about religion Islam. He did not give any concentration or he has not any intentions about religion Islam. He did not learn. He did not come at right path. He don't know about religion Islam. My dear brother, it's a big loss. No small loss, it's a big loss. Because we have a fixed time of life. And I can't understand why people do not accept to the style of the Holy Prophet of the I can't understand. Alhamdulillah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had announced if anyone he will adopt, he will accept one style of my beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu ta'ala alayhi wa alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam, he will get reward equal to 100 martyrs. Those people they have sacrificed in the cause of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, one style. Amma Masrib is a one style of beloved Prophet. Beard is a style of your Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Proper Sunnah clothes is a proper is a style of beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. If we will care, if we will learn, if we will get knowledge, only in meal, in breakfast, lunch and dinner, about to 80 Sunnah of beloved Prophet, please be upon him, are available, 80 Sunnah. When the one reward of one style equal the one hundred times martyrs, shuhada. By this reward we can get a light in grave, we can be success, success in grave, we can be success in judgment day, we can enter in paradise by this style. We are accounting over different items we are accounting. My dear brother, 
This is a big loss for us. And if we will not care from devil, devil can destroy our all good deeds, can waste our all good deeds when we will not care. My dear brother, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Ya yuhalladzina amanu, Qo anfusakum wa ahliyakum naram wa quduhan nasu wal hijaratun alayha malaikatun ghilazun shidadullah. Ghilazun shidadullah ya'asun Allah. Ma amarahum wa yaf'aluna ma yu'maroon. Para number 28 and surat surat tahreem verse number 6. اے ایمان والو اپنی جانوں اور اپنے گھر والوں کو اس آگ سے بچاؤ جس کا ایندن آدمی اور پتر ہیں اس پر سخت کرے فرشتے یعنی سخت دل مقرر ہیں جو اللہ کا حکم نہیں ٹالتے اور جو انہیں حکم ہو وہی کرتے ہیں Oh you believe save yourself and your family from a fire whose fuel is men and stones over which are appointed angels, stars and savers who flinch not from executing. He will not accept any excuse. The commands they receive from God, but do precisely what they are commanded. <coughs> which order they receive from Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala, they will do. They will not accept any excuse. They have not any politeness. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gave them order, throw them in hellfire. They will took, they will take, and throw them in hellfire. They have not polite condition. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created them in this position. They will have not accept any excuse of any person. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Qad afla man tazakka wa zakar asma rabbihi fasalla. Surah al-A'la, verse number 15. Beshak murad ko pohuncha, jo sutra hua aur apne rab ka naam le kar namaz padhi. But those will prosper who purify themselves and glorify the name of their guardians, Lord, and in prayer. Beshak Murad ko poncha, indeed there will be success. Which one? He will get a purification. He will get a neat and clean position. Meaning neat and clean body, neat and clean clothes, neat and clean heart, neat and clean brain. What is meaning heart and brain? When we will not think about any criminal activities, about bad activities, about any sin, automatically our brain, our heart will be neat and clean. Tell us one of the ayahs says, those people, they will be successful. And, apne rab ke naam le kar namaz padi. They are reciting the name of Allah. They are reciting the zikr. La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah. La ilaha illallah. Allah wa salli ala Muhammad wa ali wa itrati bi adhi kulli ma'alumin la kadrude pa. Ya Allah, ya Rahman, ya Rahim, ya Kareem, ya Sattar, ya Ghaffar, ya Hannan, ya Mannan. Subhanallah wa bihamdihi, Subhanallah al-Azim. Meaning they are very sincere with Allah, the Almighty Subhanahu wa ta'ala, and with the religion Islam, and about the life of them. They need success in grave, in this world, in grave, and hereafter. Poor children all the time, we are playing videos, cards, video games, meaning they are wasting time, my brother. Oh, my children, my dear students, dear children, remember, we have a fixed time and we don't know about limit of time, about our limit, our age. 
we have 10 years, we have 20 years, 30 years, 40 years, 50 years, 60 years, 70 years, we don't know. We can't give, give guarantee. If we will waste our time in videos, in court, in, you know, you know, all students, all near about, near about 80% students, they are playing on internet and games. And my children, this, you are wasting time. In this time, for example, you are reading Allah Masalli Allah Muhammad wa Ali wa Itrati Biyadati Kulli Maalu Millaka. One hundred times you will recite. I think in five five minutes you can read five in five minutes you can read one hundred times through the Quran. Allah Masalli Allah Muhammad wa Ali wa Itrati Biyadati Kulli Maalu Millaka. Allah Masalli Allah Sidna Maula Muhammad wa Ali wa Ali Sidna. Assalamu alaikum wa alaikum ya Rasulullah wa Ali wa Sallam. What is, what is reward of this recitation? The beloved Prophet Muhammad says, if anyone will read one time through Shreed, Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala give him ten times blessings and will increase his ten spiritual stages. If anyone he will read ten times through Sharif, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will give him one hundred times blessings and one hundred spiritual stages will be increased. He will go nearest. His, his soul will travel to closer stage of Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala. If anyone he will read one hundred times Durood Shreem, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will write between eyes of them. This person is free from hypocrites and hellfire and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will bring them in line of shuhada. Those people, they have sacrificed in course of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, meaning, sh meaning shuhada, they will be stand up with shuhada on judgment day. This is reward, or if anyone he is wasting time in billiard game and in any video games and other games and what is when when they receive number they say ha 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 I success I win when they lost game they say, oh oh I have lost oh oh four. what happened I have lost my game. My dear brothers, we are not thinking about our life. If any prayer, for example, we have leave any prayer, should be, should be, should be. Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina wa lana Muhammadin wa alayhi wa sallam alayhi wa sallam. It should be think about, about our wastings. Prayers, your time, your good deeds. The Holy Prophet, peace be upon him, says if anyone he will leave Asr prayer, he will left to Asr prayer, his all good activities will be wasted. In other declaration, if anyone he will leave and if anyone he will leave Asr prayer, uska ghar bar malo dolat lut gaya, meaning. He has lost to all properties, all families, house, all bounties. Should be worried about these conditions. Oh my God, I my prayers, I leave my prayer, oh my God. My dear brother, we have a very valuable time, very valuable life. If we will care, then inshallah, successful. If we will not care, <coughs> This loss is our loss, not, not loss of any other person. This is our loss. If we will care, we will get reward. If we will not care, we will get punishment. My dear brother, Allah the Almighty subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَمَارْ سَلْنَاكَ قَوْلَكَ إِلَّا رِجَالًا نُوْهِ وَمَارْ قبل كايلا رجال نوحي إليهم فاسألوا أهل ذكر إن كنتم لا تعلمون أو